Hey folks, it's Mangrel. Welcome back to the channel. And we are now in my office. So we're out of the furnace room and I want to do a little bit of practicing with this remote. So I mentioned to you that I was using the black DJI remote and now with the O3 unit, I have to use this guy. And this guy feels a lot different. So you can see the gimbals are super small. So I wanna see, can I connect this to the flight simulator I typically use on the computer, which is liftoff and whether it works. So you will require a new USB cable. I got this from Amazon. I will link you in the video description. So let me go ahead and turn it on and we will see if this will work or not. So I'm just gonna plug it in here. Okay, so the computer is doing something. So I'm hoping that the computer is installing software. And then now I'm gonna try launching liftoff. And now in liftoff, we're gonna go under the options and let's see if it's found the controller. So controller, and I see it has found the HID interface, but nothing's happening. So if I disconnect, okay, so it is detecting the controller, but for some reason it's not doing anything. It's not reacting. So let me try uh, select, no, there's only one option. So again, nothing's happening. Let me go to calibrate. So start calibration, rotate all sticks. Okay, so yeah, now it, it is picking it up. So I think it's just a calibration issue. So center all sticks, let's center. So my sticks are all centered. It says, okay, uh, assign axis throttle. So this would be throttle, center all sticks, center all sticks, okay. Uh, assign axis pitch. So this is pitch, center all sticks. Okay, right, this is a pretty cool little uh, calibration. So center all sticks. And the last one should be yaw. So here's yaw, center all sticks. Oh, it's not centered, center all sticks. Okay, yeah, there we go. So now we're in business. Okay, so it looks like it does work. So let's save it, let's exit, and let's do a quick test and make sure that it does respond correctly in here. So I wanna do freestyle play. I haven't flown for 10 months, so bear with me. I'm probably gonna really suck, but let's see what we can do. Oh, which quad do I even use? All right, that's good enough. CL1. All right, so, and we're off. Yeah, this seems to work. Look, I did an aileron roll. Yes. All right, backflip. Okay, so it looks like this. Oh, it's all backwards. How come? Okay, something's wrong. I have to go back through the settings, but my, my yaw's backwards. <laughs> all right, I think the main point of this video was, does it actually, ooh, this is all backwards. Does it actually work with the DJI remote? And the answer is yes, it does. You do have to go through that calibration and it looks like we do have to somehow reverse our yaw pitch because the pitch uh, the yaw pitch? No. The, the yaw is backwards. So I'm going left, it's going right. So definitely something is, is up there, but uh, just some fine tuning. So there you go. Yes, you can use your DJI controller too with the PC simulator. Yeah, so here's where I went wrong. So I'm going left and you see it's going right. So I think when I did the calibration, it was my fault, my bad. I pushed the, the remote the wrong way, the, the stick. So I just need to invert that and now we're all good. All right, so make sure you like, subscribe, comment and stay tuned for more videos.